Hello guys, Elliot Craft here, making another yo -Oh Watch video. Alright, so last episode, um, we had a really short chapter, um, and then we, um, tried to farm Snarl, he destroyed me, so, um, yeah, I did, like, a side quest. Anyway, so today we're just gonna continue on with the main story. Actually, you know what? First thing we're gonna do, head over to Timers and More, which is a watch shop, to see if I can upgrade my watch. Alright, yeah, we also got the bike last episode, which is really nice. Alright, well, yeah, I can upgrade my watch. Well, hello, I figured you'd be coming back soon, and here you are. I wanna make friends with some stronger yokai, eh? Yeah, can you make my yokai watch stronger again? Oh yeah, there's plenty more we can do with that yokai watch of yours. And I've got all the materials ready. Quick do the job any old time. But before that, mind if I ask you for a little favor? Don't tell me you lost your lucky underwear again. Please don't tell me that. I didn't lose anything, I just need to make sure you're strong enough. Strong enough? We're playing that watch that child's play, you know? I want to make sure you won't end up overwhelmed by our new friends. The higher your rank, the tougher times you're going to see. Ah yes, of course. Well then, which one do you do? It's not very complicated. I just want you to defeat the following yokai. All three of them are based in downtown Springdale. First is Signal Wall. You'll find him in the Academy Shortcut. Second is Suspicioni. You'll find him in the alley behind Frostia's place. Finally, Tantroni. He's in the delivery bay south of the arcade. Once you've defeated them all, come back and see me. I'll strengthen up your yokai watch a look at split. Well, that sounds pretty reasonable. I'm sure we can do it. Let's go get these yokai. All right. So we can probably easily beat these yokai because, well, really good team. All right. So they're in downtown Springdale, which I have to go down one area and then to the right one. Alright, so let's throw Yokai after beat. And the first one is right in this alleyway here. Yeah, this is signal. Yummy on yummy on water energy. Huh? Who are you? I don't know my phone. I'm gonna have to ask you to get out of here. Alright, so to beat three signable. Yeah. Oh, okay, I have to try to look at the because he's lightning and the cap is water. Alright, that was a pretty easy fight. So, let's see, the next one is down by the arcade, over here, yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, this is the arcade. Yeah, okay, so this is the delivery bay, we fight Tantroni here. What's with you guys? You think you can exterminate me? Haha, <laughs> I only use one good smack to take you out. Oh, I forgot the heal will cap up. Okay, I'll just search the title tile here. You know, reunite is loafing. Oh, gosh. Alright. So we have one yokai left to beat. 
Yokai. All right, it's especially only by Frosty this place. All right, so that's up here and this alleyway. You're kind of suspicious. If you get away, I'm gonna take care of you. Oh, because of these spirits will trap us. Ooh, a case of a pure Timers and more until we get the C rank watch. Which, by the way, we need to actually do the story. So. Yeah. Oh, wrong way. You yeah, have to go up here. Okay, so, yeah, we're here. Alright, looks like you defeated all of the yokai. You passed the test, kid. Let me go ahead and upgrade that yokai watch of yours. Awesome, sounds great. Okay, a little bit of this, and this goes like that, and there. Now you'll be able to see Yoka there one rank higher. Alright. Also, now you can befriend more powerful Yoka. Just be careful out there. The higher rank the Yoka are, the more dangerous they are, too. Alright. Now we can do the main story. Yellow coin, so you can go use that right now. Oh, wait, I can upgrade again? Okay, actually, I might just devote this episode to doing side quests and stuff, because I can already upgrade my watch again. Listen, Mr. Snapper, I know you want to get that watch all spectacle, but I need you to pass the test. Same deal as last time, just read the yokai list off. If you do, I'll upgrade your watch. I'm getting the feeling that this is an important step in our journey. Let's do our best, always. If you're ready, I'm gonna list off the yokai I need you to defeat. King Gulick and Frickin' Sight, Nine Hunts Radio. Flumpy's in the shopping street narrows on Flowerwood Road. And lastly, Man Mountain over in the abandoned town. Once you've defeated all of them, come back and see me. Got it? Jeez, that's how seems like it has some tough enemies. But we can do this. Okay, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna go on with the main story, because that's kind of in a lot of places. And one of them is in where we have to go for the story, so. Yeah. We can use a um, coin at the end of the episode. Alright, so right now we have to head to Flower Road. And go to the bookstore.
I told you before, sir. We have absolutely no intention of doing that. Look, I've got a lot to do, so I'm afraid I must ask you to leave. Fine then. I'll be back. I wonder what was just going on there. Looks like some sort of trouble may be brewing. Let's ask the shopkeeper. Hey there, Elliot. Sorry you had to see that. Everything okay? Yeah, it's just my daily visit from those builders who want this property. They want to turn this place into some generic mall. Do you believe that? Well, wait, what? Really? And tear down the flower road? Well, I'm not going anywhere. But still, something's been bothering me. Strange sure things have been happening ever since the mall talk started. Everyone's saying that the guardian angel is angry. Oh, sure, the, uh, guardian angel. Yeah, sure, right. That's the guardian deity of Flower Road. We'll be homeless if we go bulldoze for a row of jumbo pretzel kiosks. Now, I'm not superstitious, but I said something out the other day. Oh, oops, sorry, I actually really have a lot of work to get to. But if interested in finding out more about what's going on, he might ask that science teacher to some more details. He seems to know a lot about it. He was just here, actually. He might still be around. Alright, so... Talk to my science teacher, who's up here. See what he knows. Hey there, Elliot. Oh, hi, Mr. Burton. What a surprise to see you here. Hey, <laughs> hey. So, how's it going? School is great. I love school. You're a great teacher. Uh, can you tell me what you know about Flower Road deities? Uh huh. Well, it's good to see you too, Elliot. You want to know about the Guardian Angel's Curse, don't you? I think so. Is that what people are calling it? I'm not sure it is a curse, per se, but strange things are definitely afoot. We've seen a lot of accidents. There was a fire after the Molpox began. Nothing has really escalated into a big problem. Not yet, anyway. I can't help but wonder what will happen if this continues, though. Oh, well, I hadn't heard about any of this before. This kind of thing can start as mischief, but it can really escalate quickly. I believe your classmate Lucas was there when the fire started. Lucas? If you're interested, if you're interested, you might want to ask him what he knows. I'll start all over at the aftermath on my way here. He might still be there. I like the way this guy thinks. Let's go see what this Lucas knows. Thanks, Mr. Martin. No problem. Always happy to talk about ghosts and curses. Be careful, Elliot. And if you find anything, you didn't hear about it from me. Alright, so now if we go to talk to Lucas at the, um, every mart down here. Alright, so he is over here on this right side. Oh, hi, Elliot. You picked me up some gum, too? I'm not, actually. But I'm glad I ran into you. I wanted to ask you something. Oh, yeah? What's up? I heard you were around when that fire started. Is that true? Yeah, that's true. I must have been seeing things because that's where that fire started on its own. I knew it would get better if it, if it spread, so I took, I took off to find a grown-up. They put their fire out really fast, so that was it. But they still don't know how it started. There's no doubt in my mind there's a yokai behind us. Lucas didn't see anyone set the fire because he can't see yokai. Where did the fire start, Lucas? It was over near Nocturne Hospital. Nocturne Hospital? Didn't that place shut down a while ago? You got to go there and investigate. Thanks for the info, Lucas. Alright, so Nocturne Hospital is just an abandoned hospital. Hmm, this place looks abandoned. This certainly is the spookiest abandoned hospital I've ever seen. Oh, Elliot, point your watch over in that direction, quickly. Right, this is Kiwi. It's a fox okay. I don't like this. Oh no no no. I don't like this one bit. They will pay dearly for messing around in my territory. I can punish them myself, but where's the fun of that? Is that the guardian angel everyone was talking about? I'm not sure. It could be a different guardian angel. Yes, of course it's, it's probably that one. His aura is quite powerful. This one is a true guardian spirit. You boys don't seem to have any respect for personal space either. You call me in dreadful mood, that's bad news for you. I'll take care of you soon, but not here and not now. 
When night falls, meet me over at the construction site downtown. We'll play then. Be there. Or live with the regret. Okay, so we just bowed. What a gentleman. Well, that was weird. Hmm, there's something about his attitude that makes me curious. Let's head to the construction site at nightfall. If he's behind the accents of Flower Road, we need to put a stop to him. Agreed. Oh, okay, I have to actually go to my house. Wow. I have to head back to the construction site. Earring watch actually get in here, so. Why? Sob. Wah. Hey there, what's wrong? I don't think this Okai is local. Why are you crying? What's your name? I'm Komasa. I left my shrine in the country and wound up here. I was looking for a place to live, so I wanted to see QB. He's in charge of this place, and he told me to meet him here, but there's a bunch of yokai there, and I can't get to where he is. Because it's too scary. The same QB that told us to come here. Interesting. I wonder if he's already inside the building here. Huh? Yeah, he said he'd be inside. Alright, Elliot, let's go. Okay. Wait, are you inside? Could you could you take me with you? I wanna show you that I'm not a scaredy cat. Well, I certainly wouldn't say no. What do you think, Elliot? Why not? It wouldn't be as scary if we all got together. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I won't let you down, honest. Alright, so we just got Komason, who is really good. So I have to add Comus onto my team. Yeah, I have to swap out, I'm gonna swap out Darumatro because he's actually kind of weak. Building. I'm gonna try to go through as fast as I can. Yeah. Oh, did you guys just feel that? Oh my swirls, that was scary. Everyone okay? No, sniffle. Come on, don't be a scary cat. That's why QB likes teasing me, you know? Show him he's wrong. Sob, okay, shudder. Oh, okay, he's not chasing me anymore. Uh, 
Okay, I have to go across this bridge slowly. I don't want to fall. And um, I guess I jump down here. And then go up here. There we go. Okay, here we go. Hey, does anyone else get the feeling that somebody's watching us? Yeah, that is the um, boss of this chapter. Massive face. Now I don't feel anything. What about you, Whisper? Of course not. No one else is here. Okay, but I don't know. That's just such a weird feeling. I'm sorry. Alright. So we're almost to the top. Oh, yeah. Amazing milk is the best milk in the game. Nice to have some. Oh, no. Castellius the third. Alright, we're already at the boss. Just gonna save. So, this guy's kinda hard, but you know, he's pretty easy. We found him! Oh no, there he is, it's Hubie! Oh, whoa, whoa, if it isn't weak, little scaredy cat Komasan. I'm surprised you all made it up here. It must be hard going up all those flights while holding each other. So, you want something for me? Is that right? You wanna know why, you wanna know why I'm trying to scare people over at Flower Road? Why would you put a curse on a place like that? So rude, see, this is why I can't ever have children. It kills you when you understand nothing. It's quite comical, actually. Especially when I led you right to the real cause of it. We're pretty spring though, right? We'll go for it, kid. Alright, so. Another bow. Alright, this guy's purple fingers. I didn't know this one. Dang. He has those British teeth. Alright. So, this guy is pretty easy. He's kind of hard. You have to attack his eyes. Rice ball for Comic-Con. Banyan combo. Okay. I just attack his forehead. Oh, I see him again. Oh, he didn't really do much. Okay, he missed because his eyes are closed. Okay, Banyan just guarded for some reason. Oh no, he opened his eyes! No! Alright, there we go.
Like a beef tongue. Like a beef tongue. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, now he's blind. Why is that not working? Ooh, 113. I'm trying to do a lot of that. I'm gonna switch over to um, Koma Gira too, because they both get a stat boost, which is nice. My Koma Sun is doing a ton of damage. Oh, okay, Koma Gira is a lot weaker. I'd rather have that in Yeah. Oh no, oh no. Yeah. Oh wow, I put a lot of down to the paddle though. Which is not true. Yeah. Alright, this should be it. This should finish him off. Yeah, it's gonna miss because he's blind and he can't see it. Oh no, oh no. He's gonna switch over to here so try to help him heal. Oh no, I'm gonna focus on his forehead since he's so close to that one. Oh no. Ooh, almost dead, almost dead. Uh, I thought someone was gonna go for the big damage, but nope. No bad man. He's a no, 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 how loud. Okay, Komasan, there we go. Alright, that was a pretty easy job, you know? So that was Master Face, that's like the, um, the, um, eighth chapter done, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Ha 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 ha, serves you right. That's what you get for messing around in my territory. Littering you here was the right idea after all. I'm just so smart. I thought Masterface had you there for a second, but <laughs> Kiwi just completely took advantage of us. Huh? How so? Can someone explain to me what's going on? He just let us out here so we could defeat that giant nail cart for him. That thing escapes you, oh pasty faced floaty one. My face isn't pasty. I like to think of myself as ivory complected. The fire of flower road was actually my rope, but that's another yokai. This may come as a surprise to you, but I love living here. And I'll continue my guardian duties in here until you learn the truth. I'll be cheering you on from afar. He bowed again. Dang. He's too much of a gentleman. Well, I found I'm really unsatisfied, but at least we're safe. What do you think Huey meant by learning the truth? I guess that's our homework from here on out, eh? Oh, I wanted to thank you for taking me along. Can we be friends? We're already friends, Komazan. We've already been through the good and the bad together, after all. You even showed Chibi that you're not a charity cat. Not totally, anyway. Yeah, Chibi shouldn't give you any more trouble now. Thank you so much, Elliot. I'm so happy, Sob. You can stop crying now. Alright. So that was the end of chapter, um, Eight. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
See you next time. Bye.